Welcome back to Fair Game. I'm Christine Leahy here with the human crash test dummy, Eric Burns. It is time for first and 10. First proudest moment in the majors. Proudest moment in the majors. Um, I think just getting there. And the first time showing up in Cleveland and 45,000 fans packing the stadium and looking around. And I remember stepping out on the ledge and like doing like a like spin circle thing. Yeah. I'd never been so scared in my life. Oh, <laughs> I mean, it was just wild. But, um, you know, and I looked up and I saw my mom was in the stands and, and my sister and it was just like, whoa, like this, uh, this is real. First pitcher you hated facing. Uh, Bing Young Kim was, he's the nastiest pitcher I ever faced. I mean, it's sidearm and, uh, reliever typically for most of his career, but he was like 96 miles per hour from right here. Would throw a Frisbee slider that would start in the, literally behind me and end up in the left-handers batter's box. And I faced some of the best, the hall of like Randy Johnson, Pedro Martinez, Greg Maddox, like I, and, and it's weird because when people ask me this question, Bing Young Kim is always the first name that comes to mind. First pitcher you loved facing? Oh, I don't know. When you get to that big league level, it's not. It's, it's tough to say you love facing any of those guys. Yeah. But I didn't mind facing Greg Maddox, and I'd say that just because I was always up for the challenge, and I knew I was facing this Hall of Famer. I always felt like I had nothing to lose, um, and it was a constant chess match of uh, trying to match not only skills but wits with one of the brightest dudes that's ever taken the mound. First thoughts on Tom Brady, the baseball player. <laughs> Tom was one of the best high school baseball players I, I saw. Hmm. I mean, quite frankly, he was a left-handed hitting catcher with an absolute hose. And, you know, I t told this story a few different times, but he hit one of the furthest home runs that I ever saw hit in a high school game. It was across the street. Uh, at St. Francis, my Catholic high school, and it landed on top of the building, which happened to be a Planned Parenthood building. So I always say, I don't know what's more ironic, that Tom Brady hit the furthest home run I ever saw hit in a high school game, or it landed on top of a Planned Parenthood building across the street from my Catholic high school. It's a little twisted. First thing your wife would say <laughs> about you. Uh, I'm nuts. Oh, yeah. She would say you're nuts. Yeah, I, you know what, I, Christine, I'm <laughs> really fortunate to be able to have found someone that puts up with my <laughs> quite honestly. I, it's, I'm a little all over the place, as I think this interview is probably <laughs> showing. Um, but she's just, she's got me uh, from the get go, and I, you know, I think it's mutual, and yeah. and I think that, you know. Life is about relationships, whether it's with your spouse or a significant other, just friendships, like everything mm -hmm. um, that we do in life has to do with interactions with, with people. And um, the more we're there to support somebody else, the more other people are going to be there to support you. So I think we all need to just make sure that it's always mutual love that's being shared and going back and forth. Okay, coming up, Eric shows off an impressive skill that you will not want to miss. Check out our YouTube channel, Fair Game on FS1, to catch all the best highlights of our show. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you never miss an episode.